Hey, MJ. Peter, head to Soho. I have a lead I need you to check out. One of my jailhouse sources just told me that some of Hammerhead's guys are always at a certain pizza shop. Maybe you can trail them, find out where Hammerhead's supplies are. You know, just once I'd like to have a phone call where we talk to each other about our days, like normal people. Okay, so, honey, how was your day? Well, uh, Sable and I caught some bad guys. Oh, so you are working together. In concept. You two have to find a way to work it out. Hammerhead's too powerful to take on alone. My jailhouse source also said that Hammerhead's using this Project Olympus stuff to, quote, improve himself even further. Further? He was already a walking tank. Exactly my point. If you two don't stop him soon, he might become unstoppable. Too many people around. I'm not gonna be able to get close looking like this. Maybe if I ditch the suit. There. Now I'm just your average New Yorker. Hey, I think that's the place that got a three-star review in the Bugle last week. No wonder it's crowded. They're mine or yours? Mine. Yeah, what's up? Okay, tell them we're on our way. Hey, come on. We gotta run an errand for Tony. Now? We're almost to the front of the line. I know, I know. Just come on. We need to run an errand for Tony? Those have to be Hammerhead's men. Better follow him. But not too close. So what do we gotta do for Tony? Get his laptop. Guess he left it in his car. You serious? Why can't he get his own damn laptop? Boss probably hasn't doing something more important. Somebody following us. Be cool, Pete. Be cool. <laughs> Guess not. Well, where is the boss, anyway? I don't know. Tony probably does, though. He's tight with the boss. Damn, <laughs> freaking Tony. Man, I should be the one who's tight with the boss. Okay, sure. Hey, that kid look familiar to you? Oh, look, someone posted a cat video. Better watch that right now. Look the same. He's also the one who helped the boss come up with that trap for the Sable chip. Yeah, like that's ever gonna work. I don't know. Sounds like a good plan to me. And if we get her, we get the rest of her stuff, so... So now you're on Tony's side? Yeah, I see how it is. Listen, I'm gonna go talk to Sal. Keep people off the lot for a minute. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, frickin' Tony. We gotta get closer to hear what they're saying. If I can't get next to them, maybe I can get above them. I need to get out of sight. Can't be climbing walls until I'm hidden. No one can see me. Now I can climb up to the rooftop. If I get above those guys, I can hear them. We gotta get to that alleyway. <laughs> Where on my mother's grave? Guy thinks he's next in line. Ha! <laughs> next in line to shine my shoes, maybe. Ain't that the truth. Anyways, Tony said he needs his laptop. Guess it's got all kinds of important stuff on it. As laptops do. Put it up in C3. Slot C3, huh? If I can get Tony's laptop, it could lead me to Hammerhead. Thanks. Oh, wait. <laughs> Stimulating conversation, guys, but I've heard enough. Spider-Man! Take him out! Kill you! Uh. 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 
Okay, now where's that laptop? That's not it. <sighs> nope. <sighs> well, hello there, Tony's laptop. See if I can hack into it. Bada bing. Looks like he's got a find my phone app installed. Let's see where you are, Tony. Hey, Pete. Hi, honey. How's your day? <laughs> Busy. Neck deep in research on some car, yeah. I'll make it quick then. Your tip was a good one. I'm on my way to one of Hammerhead's top men. If anybody knows where Hammerhead is, it's him. That's great. And one of his guys mentioned setting a trap for Sable. What do you think that means? I think it means a bunch of old school Magia thugs feel threatened by a confident, powerful woman. Uh, right. Sorry, Pete. I don't mean to blow you off, but I'm on a deadline, so... Yeah, totally. Talk later. I don't know when she's coming. You just gotta be ready. There's Tony. I don't think that's enough, guys. Double it up. Did a problem. I see him! Spider-Man! I'll break you, little man! You're gonna pay for that! Think I can't get you up here now! Spider-Man. You see that Sable chick? You tell her, my boss wants to have a sit down. Yeah, I could. But she doesn't really listen to me. Or anyone. Give me the address. Wait, where, how did, the address! Uh, Colexco building, rooftop. No, wait, it's probably an ambush! Sable, you're headed into a trap! It does not matter, as long as Hammerhead is there. You don't get it! I'm trying to keep you from getting hurt! I can take care of myself. Usually you can, but Hammerhead's been using your Project Olympus stuff. I know. Then you know he's turned himself into some kind of giant Franken-monster. And that is why I must stop him. But not like this. Not by going right into a trap. Ah, oh, Sable, what are you doing?
a trap. If only we had some kind of advanced warning. Ugh, I can handle this. I'm sort of tempted to sit back and watch, but that would just be petty. They trapped her with their own tech. Looks like the whole thing is powered by those generators. One down. You doing okay in there, Sable? Or is it silver? Or is it something else? You better cut it! Hang tight while I work on the other ones. <laughs> Get it? Hang tight? Shut up. You know, talking about your feelings has been scientifically proven to reduce stress and improve mood. I'm just saying, you'd be doing us all a favor. Get out of here! No. Stay here. Uh. Hammerhead will come to us. Uh, not so sure that's a good idea. Please get out of here now! Uh. 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 
You're alive. Did you honestly think I was dead? Uh, uh, how, how did you find me? Same way she did. Watch out. That girl has trust issues. How long have you been watching me? Watching us? Long enough to know you're making a mistake. Hammerhead's gotten too powerful. Do you really think I have a choice? Here. Wait, is that... Everything you need to know about that ugly thing. Sorry for what I did to you. But now we're even. One more thing. His head... Not as strong as you think it is. Bye, Felicia. Let's see what's on this thing. If they're keeping Sable in that base, I bet they have those stolen humanitarian supplies in those other bases. I should call David about this. Hello. Hi, David. It's Spider-Man. I think I may have found those humanitarian supplies bound for Simcaria. Great. Can you send me the locations? Well, there's just one wrinkle. They're in heavily fortified bases guarded by bionic madmen with futuristic weapons and impenetrable armor. That is quite a wrinkle. Why don't I scope out their hideouts first and get back to you? Thank you, Spider-Man. I greatly appreciate all your help. Time to check in with MJ. Peter, are you okay? I saw people posting pictures of you and Hammerhead and Sable and... And Black Cat. Normally she brings bad luck, but not this time. I knew she was still alive. What was she doing there? Saving my skin. And giving me a lead on Hammerhead's hideouts. It turns out he's been stashing all of the stolen Sable tech underground. What? How? I'm on my way to find out. And hopefully rescue Sable. If she's still alive. Listen. I've been digging into this Simcaria thing. 
It's a big story. Something I feel like I need to be a part of. My boss agrees. Wait, you're going... <laughs> Hi, David. I'm at one of the hideouts. I'm surprised Sable had you working alone on this. I resigned from Sable International in order to ensure the supplies made it to some carrier. Guess she's a true mercenary at heart. Even choosing weapons over aid for her own people. Sable is more than a mercenary. Trust me. Anyway, let me know if you find those supplies. And thank you. Sable's home country, Simkaria. Well, the Simkarian government has been consolidating power for over a decade. They are now effectively a dictatorship. The opposition party, led by the Sabinova family, was either exiled or executed. Simkaria has been in civil war ever since. Meanwhile, the civilians are caught in the middle, with no way to escape and no way to go. So Sable might have lost some of her family in the conflict. Yes, the conflict in Simkaria is more personal to her than she will ever let on. We're gonna pound your face in! How do you do that? Oh! 
sound angry. Must be the lack of sunlight. Watch out! I'll snap your spine! Who needs a nap? Hey, David, got a question. 
wanting that noise. Are you fighting right now? Oh, yeah. I'll try to keep it down. I was just wondering, how much do you know about Sable's home country, Simkaria? Well, the Simkarian government has been consolidating power for over a decade. They are now effectively a dictatorship. The opposition party, led by the Sablinova family, was either exiled or executed. Simkaria has been in civil war ever since. Meanwhile, the civilians are caught in the middle, with no way to escape and no way to go if they do. So Sable might have lost some of her family in the conflict. Yes, the conflict in Simkaria is more concerned to her than she will ever let on. How did he do that? Curious. When you guys get food delivered, do they just drop it down the sewer drain or what? Yeah! <laughs> 
sure hope so. You guys are terrible hosts.
Okay. Those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. Time to find that stash of humanitarian aid. Okay, those humanitarian supplies should be around here. There are the supplies. Hi, David. I recovered some of your supplies. Sending you the location now. Thank you, Spider-Man. I will get there as fast as I can. Great. And if it helps, I have a couple police contacts. I can ask them to help you out if... Oh, no, no, no. That will not be necessary. I have it under control. Thank you again. Huh. Alrighty. Work out the... Sorry, I'm back. So Hammerhead's been stashing all of the stolen Sable tech underground. What? How? I'm on my way to find out, and hopefully rescue Sable, if she's still alive. Listen, I've been digging into this Simcaria thing. It's a big story, something I feel like I need to be a part of. My boss agrees. Wait, you're going to Simcaria? When? Tonight. It's a rapidly developing situation. You and Sable can take care of Hammerhead. You don't need me. Just because I don't need you doesn't mean I don't need you. That's sweet. But listen, other countries are ignoring this crisis, including ours. These people are helpless, all alone in the middle of a war zone. If I document what's happening and share it with the rest...